Okay, we're Perfect. Going. Okay. Bueno, pues, uh, buenos días, tardes, noches, depende a qué hora vas a ver este video que vamos a subir aquí al Facebook. Estoy aquí en vivo con el señor Bob McNulty. Uh, hi, Bob. Hey, hello. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. Thank you. Ok, y ahora la idea es uh, las preguntas que, algunas preguntas que me hicieron en Facebook, vamos a contestarlas y esto lo estaremos haciendo en forma periódica para mantener informado a todo, a todo el equipo de lo que está sucediendo. Uh, well, Bob, uh, I have a few questions. Yes, uh, I'm, I'm ready to answer whatever questions you have. Awesome. Uh, bien, dice Bob que está listo para contestar las preguntas, así de que para ir directamente al punto, Vamos a ir uh, directamente a las preguntas, okay? So, to go to the point, let me we'll start with the, with the questions, Bob, okay? Okay, okay? yeah. Perfect. Okay, uh, the first question is, uh, can we send the same, when the system, when the new system is uh, up and running? Yeah. Uh, well, not really, no. At this time, uh, can we send the same referral link to the same referral link to the new people? Yes, you're gonna have the same referral link that you had before, that's not gonna change. And then anybody else that signs up will be getting in the sequential uh, data, you know, so the same link, yes. Okay, sí, el, 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 el código de referencia o el número de referencia va a ser el mismo. Uh, cuando transforme el nuevo sistema, va a continuar siendo el mismo. No va a cambiar y después viene la secuencia. But the question is, as right now, we're not sending the, the link because the system is not fully well, working. Well, the, the right old system's up and running. There's nothing wrong with it. You can sign people up for free just like before and get a link. So if they want to start signing people up, they can do that. Okay. I'll be switching so, over in about two weeks, two and a half weeks. So so the, the first question was, they still can send a link right now and, 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 and bring people uh, for free, right? Correct, yes. Okay. Entonces, si la respuesta es, sí, puedes seguir enviando el sistema, ya que el, el enlace, ya que el sistema está funcionando, y solamente uh, mandar para que sea el registro gratuito, sin cobrar nada. Y cuando el sistema nuevo en un par de semanas esté funcionando y se migre todo, entonces se enviará, uh, el, pero el código va a seguir siendo el mismo. Okay, uh, next question. Uh, the information, the website, and our virtual office will be also in Spanish. Yes, the, the website, we're going to have a translator on there so they can hit it and it'll translate to Spanish. Um, the, I think, you know, the new marketing system is actually going to be in English, Spanish, and Portuguese, all three languages. See, uh, right now it's going to be like a plugin to translate it, or we'll be translating Yeah, yeah, they're, they're working on that, so they'll have to just hit the button if you want it in Spanish, it'll translate the site. It won't be as good as if we went and did it by hand, but it'll be about 85%. 90%. Okay. And maybe down the road, when the, the system is up and running, we can translate it. Like, yes. Okay. Well, our, our goal is to get completely bilingual in every aspect of the company. Okay, the app as well. Yes. Uh, sí, la respuesta es, eh, toda la página, el back office y la aplicación va a estar uh, en inglés, español y en portugués. La idea es que esté uh, completamente. En este momento va a haber un plugin que es el que va a hacer la traducción, pero posteriormente vamos a traducirlo todo con mucho, con más cuidado. Next question. Uh, when uh, the software will be available? We've, we've tested the rideshare software and the, and the app and all that's already up and running. We've been, we, we actually stopped testing it last week. Now we're on to the uh, grocery and restaurant pickup and delivery business. That, those applications are not a separate app. They actually will be inside one app. So we have one app with all these different functions. Um, those we're testing now. In fact, Lisa probably, 50 or 60 text messages today of her testing and getting on it. Um, that, they'll probably be done in about two weeks, maybe three weeks on the outside, but we're doing other things simultaneously. So one of the things we're doing simultaneously, like today, where they just finished up hooking up the commission, or excuse me, the subscription to the card processing for when you, when you bring a driver on board. And then also they finished up today the driver merchant account so when you go through the sign up process you get your merchant account automatically so that process is all up and running as of today now th that means it's up and running so they got to do testing now in a sandbox environment okay bueno entonces la respuesta es eh, 
ya se hicieron todas las pruebas de, de la aplicación para conducir. Hace ya hace un par de semanas ya no están haciendo usted pruebas porque ya está funcionando bien. Ahora se está haciendo prueba de lo que es el delivery para lo que es comida y lo que es los restaurantes para llevar este, uh, la entrega de comida. Eso está trabajándose ahora. También se está, se cree que en un par de semanas más o menos ya estará esa, esas pruebas uh, finalizadas. Ahora, es en la misma aplicación. Lo que es la entrega de, de, de alimentos y de pasajeros no son dos aplicaciones separadas. Es la misma aplicación, pero la integración de, de esa parte se está probando en este momento. Y también ya está funcionando ahora. Uh, you tell me that uh, the, the commission is already integrated. The... Yes, the, the card processing for the commissions got integrated okay. today. And the okay, card la, processing la, yes, for the driver me. account got up and running today. So now they're, they're testing probably for the next two or three days. Make sure. Okay, y también el, el sistema de la tarjeta para, para registro y para los choferes también ya está integrado y está haciendo sus pruebas también sobre de eso. So, in about two weeks, we may have uh, some uh, frame time on. Yeah, we'll on have a better when we're going to launch and what markets uh, in about two, two and a half weeks. We're looking at, uh, if you saw my video this morning, I was talking about Nashville, Atlanta. We definitely want the Florida market. The thing with the delivery uh, business, whether it's restaurants or groceries, we can open markets faster because we don't have any regulatory issues. We, we you know, all, all the driver needs to show us is a valid driver's license in their market and that they have insurance. That's it. There's no real background check to go through. Excellent. Entonces, lo que dice es de que ya es integración esta lista. Se estima que en unas dos, tres semanas más se va a poder eh, tener una fecha más cercana de, de cuándo abrir eh, eh, el mercado. Hay algunos mercados, definitivamente el mercado de Florida está, está a la vista. Y para el tema de, de entrega de alimentos, es mucho más sencillo porque las regulaciones son mínimas. Solamente se necesita una licencia de manejar y, y una aseguranza. Entonces, es mucho más fácil. No se requiere un, un uh, cheque, de, cheque de antecedentes tan extensivo como en el tema de llevar pasajeros. Así de que para lanzar eh, en lo que son los entregas de alimentos, es rápido y es mucho más sencillo. Okay, now there is a, a group of, uh, of questions, but uh, they're more like uh, talking about uh, what kind of, uh, how many dogs we can have in the cars and stuff like that. So I want to skip all those questions only because I think we, those questions are more when we open the market, like how much will be the, the price for per minute and the distance of miles, etc. So I think those questions are more like when we open the market. Yeah, I agree. Are so, so, so people understand the ride share market of taking people around is going to be another two to three months before that market even starts to come back. It's off 70 to 80%. So for us, though, the demand right now for drivers to earn money is on the pickup delivery side. They're going to be making really good money. There's, there's all kinds of commissionable rates. You'll see on Saturday in the leader meeting what we're doing. And then once, once everybody sees that, then we'll gather, we'll start gathering momentum and then we'll show the whole new plan. I guarantee you they're going to love it. It's very simple. They're going to make way more money and then get on the road right away. So that's yeah. the biggest thing. Yeah. So Ernesto, uh, for, uh, para todas sus preguntas, son preguntas más cuando el mercado ya esté abierto. Así que vamos a dejarlas para más adelante. Eh, hace varias preguntas, Ernesto. Hace nueve preguntas. Vamos a brincar esas por el momento, uh, pero a lo que está diciendo Bob es de que en este momento para llevar pasajeros va a pasar unos meses más por todo lo que está sucediendo ahora con la, con la situación del país, pero eh, por eso es de que se está empujando fuertemente para poder abrir en la entrega de alimentos, ya que eso va a dejar bastante ingresos, hay varias formas de ganar dinero y va a ser uh, mucho más fácil abrir esa parte, desde que vamos a, a empezar por ahí. Uh, second question. Uh, Oh, well, the question is that, uh, is, can the company start with delivering food and then uh, the transportation of people? Yeah. Uh, esa es la, la pregunta. Yes. La compañía yes. va a empezar. Yeah. yeah we, we want to start in the food business. And then as the market starts to come back, we'll just transition right into the rideshare business. We'll already be in the market with, you know, thousands and thousands of drivers. And if we do it right, we could have 30 or 40 markets open by the end of the year. Because the food business will drive us that way. There's no restrictions. Exactly. Yeah. Entonces, esa, esa pregunta ya está, ya se, se respondió. Sí. Uh, se va a arrancar primero 
en la industria de la entrega de comida. Uh, another question is, I would I will like to know how the influencers who pay 149 will be classified. Yeah, all the influencers are, everybody in this company as of today, before we launch, is what I, you know, it's called a legacy driver, right? So if they're paying their monthly in, uh, as a, a, a pro driver, they will get any recruiting that they do, they get a 50 and 15% two level payout. So nobody else will have that, just this group. Anybody that starts after that will only get 50 and five on two levels as a, as a pro driver. So that, that's some of the things. And then don't forget a lot of them. Also, I just sent out 2000 letters uh, for options uh, for over 2000 people. So they just got those in the mail last couple of days in the emails. On the email. So, uh, we're talking about those who pay 149, correct? Yes. Only for those who pay 149. Those who register only as a drivers, they're, they're not in this, this uh, group of people, right? A driver influencer, which almost everybody is that signed up. I mean, there's very few that just have the 149 the driver influencers. Those are all legacy drivers. They're just grandfathered in under that program. So there, there are people who, who, who sign up only as a drivers with, with the uh, 149 influencer was not available anymore, uh, no longer available. Right, so right. So if you're a driver, you're still a legacy. You're still a legacy? Yeah. Even every if, Anybody that's in our system right now, whether uh -huh. it's a, a driver influencer or just a driver or an influencer, we've just made everybody a legacy. It's just okay. a lot easier. I want to look, we've had a lot of startup issues as everybody knows. So I'm just trying to be very fair with everybody. Even on the stock options, some of the people only earned a, a, a smaller amount. I just gave everybody across the board a thousand options. Okay. So just to be clear, everybody, even those who pay only 99 will be in the legacy program, right? Yes, any anybody that's a pro driver is in the legacy program that's in the system today. Excellent. Uh, I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You'll see okay. it all when you, when you see Saturday. You're going to blow your mind, man. Yeah, perfect. I just feel well, like crazy again. Well, now noticia. we have technology, and that's awesome. Yeah, okay. Uh, bueno, para esta pregunta les va a dar mucho gusto. Entonces, todos los que estén hasta el día de hoy en el sistema, que estén como conductores pro, o sea, en, en el tiempo completo, eh, al igual que los influenciadores, todos los que entraron a la compañía hasta el día de hoy van a estar en el programa de Legacy, ¿ok? Así es de que con los beneficios de Legacy, que tienen eh, los dos niveles y que tienen el 50% de comisión directa. Así es de que es una muy buena noticia. Y el sábado van a venir nuevos anuncios donde van a estar todos muy contentos con lo que se va a decir. Ok. Uh, I'm still receiving some more questions here. Let me okay. go here. Uh, some people write a lot of stuff and then the question is yeah, in the no, middle of it. The bottom line. <laughs> yeah. So let me go here. Well, uh, just asking about how to change the password. Uh, with, uh, si tienes un problema con tu password y eso, vete por favor directamente al... Uh, al En, en, el, en el botón de la burbujita azul de tu sistema a, a, a Telegram y ahí te contestamos. ¿Ok? No Telegram, a, a Intercom. Ahí te contestan todo lo que tiene que ver con eso. One more. Uh, yeah, it's talking about why we changed the, the name Trip from Trip. Uh, it's it's, it's uh, just uh, because of the company. You want yeah, to I mean, I explained it a number of times. It's on the yeah. videos in YouTube, but I, I can tell you just quickly. Wyndham Hotels had trip hotels. And when we picked the name, our lawyer said it was fine because there was no encroachment on a copyright because of different industry. They came to us about 10 months ago. We, we didn't, there was no negotiations or anything. They just said, hey, uh, would you mind changing the, the name to TRIP from TRYP? And, and look, it's uh, we don't want to get in a, a battle over nothing, you know. So we 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 made a decision to make the change. They never said you got to do it today. We've just taken our time, and that's why we're making the change now. Just it's it's totally planned. It's nothing that's, you know, the corporate name is still Trip T R Y P, you know, Technologies. We're not changing that name. We're just doing the business, doing business as name. Uh, sí, eso ya se explicó varias veces, espero que ya quede claro esta vez. Se cambió de, de trip con Y a trip con Y latina, simplemente porque una compañía en, el en, en la industria de los hoteles eh, tenía ese nombre. 
eh, originalmente los abogados dijeron que no había problema porque eran dos industrias completamente diferentes y porque era Trip Technologies y el otro era Trip en el tema de, 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 de los hoteles. Entonces, no había problema. Sin embargo, eh, la compañía pidió que si lo podíamos no usar. Y para, no era necesario pelear esa batalla, por lo tanto, se decidió cambiar en el Doing Business As, haciendo negocios como Trip con I y Latina, pero el nombre del corporativo sigue siendo Trip Technologies con Y. Es un cambio muy sencillo que no nos afecta en nada y como la compañía está en este nuevo lanzamiento, pues en realidad no afecta en nada. Entonces, todo sigue igual, nada más se va a utilizar el nuevo logotipo. Uh, another question. Uh, dice, all the people that we register, uh, they're still on, on our downline. Yes, right? All the people, even those uh, uh, they're signed up as a free members, correct? Yeah, they belong to, if you sign them up, you sponsor them, it won't go down, it'll go two levels, but straight out. It could go a thousand wide, you know, just, it, there's no width restrictions. Yeah, and then he said, uh, I, I've been looking, I've been watching on the Facebook and also on Instagram, some photos as is the company's already uh, on business, And my question is, uh, we're waiting in California, what's going on? Yeah. Yeah, we just, you know, we'd open tomorrow, but we, we just don't know where to open yet. That's why we're looking at Atlanta, Nashville, Florida markets. They seem to be the markets that are probably going to be the quickest for us to get into. Um, so that's why we're looking at those. Yeah, another question they, they're asking me uh, is, you know, my registration was, eight months ago as a driver and influencer yeah. and still my information is in process uh and they'll have to send their information to support a yeah. trip rides and then get an answer i can't yeah have... esas preguntas que tienen que ver con el sistema uh envíenlas a soporte support at triprides.com eh, o eh, entra al sistema y no está la burbujita azul por ahí, porque esos son aspectos técnicos y las preguntas con Boba aquí son bien hacia, hacia dónde va la compañía. I'm still that all those technical questions are more for support than for yeah. you because you're just uh, you're sharing right now where the company is going, you know. Yeah, that's right. what we're doing right now. Okay, I have uh, that's it. We're done with oh. the questions. Yeah, that's it. Well, we got some real exciting stuff. So, Marco, I'm thinking maybe uh, sometime next week. Uh -huh. uh, once we get through the Saturday meeting and we, you know, show everybody, then I'd like to do the same presentation to, to this group so they can really understand what the new compensation plan looks like. I think they're going to get really excited uh, and, and see it. You know, we're, we're doing a lot of things. We're, we're, the system side was so messed up. We're not even using that system. So it's all been new and it's all coming together. It's going to be very, very powerful. Be easier okay. to use all the things that they've been wanting to have, they're going to have. El sábado viene una, uh, una actualización de todo lo que viene. Van a mostrar un nuevo plan de compensación que les va uh, a encantar, les va a gustar mucho. Toda la integración de lo nuevo que se está haciendo. No se va a usar las cosas, fijas, todo está integrado, hace completamente nuevo. Y el sábado va a haber una uh, presentación explicando todo eso. Y me está diciendo que después de eso que se va a hacer en inglés, que lo hagamos él y yo. Uh, en español para presentar toda esta nueva información para todos ustedes y estén informados. Algo que les va a dar mucho gusto cuando vean lo nuevo que tiene la compañía. Ok. ¿Qué día es bueno para hacer una conversación con ellos y mostrarles el nuevo plan para que puedan realmente obtener la comprensión de lo que estamos haciendo? Monday, well, maybe, Tuesday, whatever night works for you guys. Bueno, well, maybe you can do it uh, if you have the time. Uh, as we finish the one in English, uh, Saturday, we can back to back. Um, Yeah, I don't have any documents in Spanish, though. What I could do, okay. I, I'd really like to get it all put over into Spanish and then do it so they can really comprehend. Uh, okay. So maybe we could okay. do it Monday night. We could do it this time, Monday night or whatever. And Sounds then perfect. I could have documents. And I'll send you the documents and then you can show them on the screen. You perfect. Know? I translated. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. So uh, let me, let, 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 me uh, let them know then this uh, next Monday. Yeah, we'll have the same time, six o'clock. Same time. Okay. Yeah, perfect. Ok, entonces el sábado se, está, se va a dar la información y el lunes a las seis de la tarde estaremos en esta grabación para subirla a Facebook y tengan ustedes la información eh, correcta. Entonces el lunes 
aproximadamente a esta hora estarán recibiendo también la información ya traducida con todos los documentos traducidos al español para poder mostrarlos. Ok, okay Bob, well, okay, thank you. Well, thank I, think you. I want to just thank everybody for their patience and their hard work, and we're going to get rolling here pretty quickly now, which is starting to keep building momentum from here on. So thanks, Marco. I appreciate it, man. Have a good night. No, thank you, Bob. Okay, gracias a todos. Bendiciones. Okay, adiós. Thank you. Bye bye. Yeah.